Hi guys, this is Sarah from The Savvy Professor. And in today's video, we're going to talk about the symptoms of low oil pressure at idle. Oil pressure is very important since it influences the engine to run smoothly and last long. The oil pressure ensures that oil reaches all the engine parts that are constantly moving to lubricate them and prevent wear. Think of the functionality of oil pressure as being that of water pressure in water pipes. Just like the pressure in the pipes enables water to flow to the tanks and the taps, the oil pressure does the same by enabling oil to keep on flowing in the engine for it to function optimally. Therefore, when the car is idling or when you're driving the car and the oil pressure drops to a point where oil's not flowing to all the moving parts, the parts get unlubricated, leading to friction. So, what are the dangers of low oil pressure at idle? Engine overheating. Since the engine moving parts will not be lubricated, it increases friction, resulting in the overproduction of heat diminishing engine performance. Oil pressure ensures oil reaches all the engine's moving parts for the smooth running of the engine. If the pressure is low, the engine may experience problems running. Now, what are the common symptoms to look out for? Check engine light is on. If the oil pressure is low, the oil sensors may activate the oil warning light on the dashboard. Engine noise. Since the engine parts are not well lubricated, you may start to hear grinding noises coming from the engine. Burning oil smell. The main cause of low oil pressure is oil leakage. Therefore, you may start to smell burning oil while driving. To sum up, here's a quick tip on how to fix the issue. If you notice the above symptoms, you should change the engine's oil, check the oil pump, or clean the oil pan. If the problem is still there or you're not confident to fix it by yourself, it's recommended to take the car to a mechanic and have them fix it. Thanks for watching.